Jason's car. Last topic is infectious and non-infectious causes. As we have seen, it is important to keep public health and community health factor in mind. Health and community health factor in mind. When we think about causes of disease, we can th take that approach a little further. It is useful to think of immediate cause of disease as belonging to two distinct types. One group of causes is called infectious agent, mostly microbes or microorganisms. Diseases were diseases where microbes are in immediate cause are called infectious disease. This is because the microbes can spread in the community and disease they cause will spread with them. ओके अपनी आजूबाजू में अत्य कोविड जुए थे कि वायरसेस वायरस इजीली पोता इफेक्ट जो है आजूबाजू में बधा पर क्रिएट कर सके ऑन द अदर हेन्ड देर आर ऑल्सो डिजिजिज देट आर नॉट कॉज बाय इन्फेक्शियस एजेंट देर कोजिज कॉजिज वेरी बट दे आर नॉट एक्सटर्नल कॉजिज लाइक माइक्रोब्स देट केन स्प्रेड इन द कम्युनिटी इंस्टेड दीज are mostly internal and infectious causes for example some cancer are caused by genetical abnormality high blood pressure can be caused by excessive weight and lack of exercise you can think of many other disease where the immediate cause will not be infectious je enu reason je che e इन्फेक्शियस नहीं मतलब एनी जावा थी के एमनी साथ रहवा थी तमने इन्फेक्शन्स थाना चांसेस नहीं द वे इन विच डिज स्प्रेड एंड द वे इन विच दे केन बी ट्रीटेड एंड प्रिवेंटेड एट द कम्युनिटी लेवल वुड बी डिफरेंट फॉर डिफरेंट डिजीज दिस वुड डिपेंड अ लॉट ऑन वेधर इमीडिएट कॉज फॉर इन्फेक्शन इन योर कॉजिज आर इन्फेक्शियस और नॉन इन्फेक्शियस जो इन्फेक्शन थाय एक ने हो बीजा ने थाना चांसेस हो तो एने इन्फेक्शियस कहूँ जो एक व्यक्ति ने डिजीज हो बीजा अंदर स्प्रेड न थत हो फॉर एक्जाम्पल जेनेटिकल एबनॉर्मालिटीज कारण कैसे कैंसर कॉज थाय सर्टिन पीपल होने बॉडी अंदर व्हाइट कलर पेचिस क्रिएट थी गया देट इज बिकॉज ऑफ जेनेटिकल एबनॉर्मालिटी तब कोई मेंटल पीपल ने टच कर जाओ तो जरूरी नहीं कि तभी मेंटल थी जाओ so you are understanding that there are certain diseases which are not infectious matlab tumne enu infection lagvana ke infection through thavana chances che nahi infectious disease disease mate responsible che infectious agents we have seen that entire diversity seen in living world can be classified into two groups this classification is based on common characteristics between different organisms organisms that can cause disease are found to found wide in range of such a categories or classification some of them are viruses some bacteria some fungi some single celled animals or protozoans some diseases are also caused by multicellular organism such as worm of different kinds so there are also pictures are given to you first one is a s a r s viruses and on the top of it there is a scale which is given to you that means it is of certain micrometers very smaller in size next is a picture of protozoans of kalazar and also the shape of this particular protozoans next is bacteria that causing acne then there is a sleeping sickness is caused by trypozomas of this particular kind this are also protozoans next is ascaris which are found in intestine especially small intestine of a human body 
on the top of it there is also a scale which is given to you common example of disease caused by virus are common called influenza dengue fever aids disease like typhoid fever cholera tuberculosis anthrax are caused by bacteria many common skin infections are caused by different kind of fungi protozoans microbes you cause many familiar disease such as malaria kala kalaza all of us have also come across intestinal worm infection as well as disease like elephantiasis caused by different species of worm apne apni life ni andar cholera che diarrhea che ava fever che cold che a badha mathi ek athva ghana badha apne feel kaira j che worms je small intestine ni andar worms hoy generally tamara dadi nani keta hoy ke bahu badhu mithu na khavay that will increase the amount of ascaris in your body to aa badhu true j che apne badha e feel kairu j che ane after having this all disease also we are now healthy why it is not important that we think of this category of infect category of infectious agent the answer is that these categories are important factor in deciding what kind of treatment to be used member of each one of those group virus bacteria and so on have many biological characteristics in common all viruses for example live live in live inside host cell whereas bacteria very rarely do viruses bacteria and fungi multiply very quickly while worms multiply very slowly in comparison taxonomically all the bacteria are closely related to each other than two viruses and vice versa this means that many important life processes are similar in bacterial group but are not shared with the virus group as a result drugs that block one of these life processes in a one member of group is likely to be effective against many other member of group but the same drug will not work against micro belonging to the different group ek particular disease mate tumhe vaccine lyo to that it does not ensure of rest other disease so ek bacteria je che eni sathe work karva mate ke eni sathe fight karva mate certain medication che which are not equally applicable for viruses as an example let us take antibiotics they commonly block biochemical pathways important for bacteria many bacteria for example make a cell wall to protect themselves antibiotic penicillin blocks the bacterial process and build the cell wall as a result growing bacteria become unable to make cell walls and die easily human cell do not make cell wall anyway so penicillin cannot have such an effect on us penicillin will have this effect on any bacteria that use such a process for making cell wall similarly many many antibiotics work against only species of bacteria rather than simply working against one but viruses do not use this pathway at all and that is a reason why antibiotics do not work against viral infection if we have common cold taking antibiotics does not reduce the sovereignty or the duration of the disease however if we also get bacterial information along with the viral cold taking antibiotic will help even then antibiotic will work only against bacterial part of infection infection not the viral infection so bacteria ke vir rite kare ke pathway thi e cell wall build karvano start kar diye so penicillin type ni tablets apne laiye to e cell wall karvano band kar कंस्ट्रक्शन वर्क जमन बेक्टेरिया बंद कर दिए इवेन्च्युअली बेक्टेरिया ने डाय कर दिए देर फोर एनी फाइट कर सकी बट वेन वी टॉक अबाउट 
वायरसेस तो वायरस ने जे मेडिसिन एंटीबायोटिक्स जो है ये वायरस ने स्टॉप नहीं कर सके बट अलॉन्ग विथ वायरस अटैक इफ देर इज अ बैक्टेरियल इन्फेक्शन ऑल्सो देन इट विल हेल्प ओनली टू ओवरकम बैक्टेरियल इन्फेक्शन एक्टिविटी थर्टीन पॉइंट फाइव फाइंड आउट हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू इन क्लास हैव कोल्ड कफ और फीवर रिसेंटली हाउ लॉन्ग डिट दिस इलनेस लास्ट हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू टूक एंटीबायोटिक्स हाउ लॉन्ग वर दोज हु टूक एंटीबायोटिक्स इल हाउ लॉन्ग दोज हु नॉट टेक एंटीबायोटिक्स इल इज देर अ डिफरेंस बिटवीन दीज टू ग्रुप्स इफ येस वाई एंड इफ नॉट वाई नॉट सो बेजिकली वायरस थ्रू स्प्रेड थे डिजीज होनी अंदर एंटीबायोटिक्स की रिक्वायरमेंट ना हो जनरली लोग ने तो मेडिसिन्स की रिक्वायरमेंट ही ना हो जो खाली कॉमन कोल्ड हो बट एक बेक्टेरिया स्प्रेड थेलू कोई डिजीज होन इट रिक्वायर्स एंटीबायोटिक्स एंड इफ इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ वायरस देन इट रिक्वायर्स अदर काइंड ऑफ ट्रीटमेंट दीज टू there there would be difference in getting recovered because virus takes like larger time as compared to bacterial infection and if both are not treated well then it could be in a uh, person could be in lethargic position uh, if the amount of bacterial infection or viral infection is more nowadays we are seeing virus infection of corona so we can easily understand how harmful it may got if we do not get examined ourselves in prescribed time span that's all for now thank you